this cello my parents bought for me when I was in high school. And I have been it's been my main cello. I recently bought another cello to a couple of years ago to travel with because this almost got lost by the airlines once. So yeah, so I decided I wouldn't fly with it again. I started on guitar and then I kind of grew up taking lessons in school and then eventually getting private lessons with the school orchestra and I had very conventional cello training. sense that there is this tradition <clears throat> that is lovely and there's no reason to ignore it but then that there's not really a right and wrong in any kind of art so there, you, you know it's nice to be always exploring and not just feeling like you can do something that somebody else told you was okay to do. instrument it, it's kind of a range has a real um, it has a lot of it has a big range um, pitch wise and then also kind of texture wise so it gets this really smooth light thing and this really kind of gritty grainy growly quality <laughs> <laughs> 